want anything else. I just want this one. and welcome to part three of this shopping vlog series so people we are back at designer exchange and i know so many of you always really enjoy this when we have a look at what they have Ooh, look at this baguette there's a cheap boy bag mm -hmm. there's a cheap I mean, boy cheap bag price. yes and so this is the the real gold plated hardware so here and here, what do we think about this Fanny Baguette? Yeah, I mean, they were, they were cool for about five minutes. I yeah. had to buy one. <laughs> I know, you wanted one so badly, <laughs> Denise. Yes, such a beautiful bag. And look at the vachetta leather. It still looks absolutely yes. pristine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we are going to have a look what's new at Designer Exchange now. And did anything catch our eye already? Remember when I bought this one in like the Emerald Forest yeah, yeah, Green? Yeah. Um, so I love Vanilla that so much. This one looks like it's a little bit in better shape still, right? Um, let's look at Chanel because Denise spotted something. Show me. Show me what he spotted. We had our hopes high up, right, for this, this one. That this would be caviar. Yes. And 2, yes, plus. we were hoping it. Even four, I think, would have been a good price. Yeah, this is medium and it has uh, scratches. Yes. yes. You can see the edges as well. And hair. Yeah, but it's still, this looks better than the one we saw in yeah. boutique. No, of course. <laughs> and then we have some scratches. Yeah, here. yeah. Um, but I think um, because the prices go up so drastically now. Um, in the boutiques, mm -hmm. they go up so drastically here as well, right? So you think this will be like more on Monday but still here? Well, I think it's already reflected in the price. Okay. Yeah. Um, so this is going to cost more than six now, I think. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, what is this? Look at this beautiful fabric. Fabric Chanel, classic flap. Mm. I also like the red one. I think you have yeah, the video. Yeah, I know. Right? The shiny. Yeah. That's a, such a beautiful yeah. one. It's a reissue. That's the original classic bag. So Coco Chanel brought this one out. Karl Lagerfeld basically, you know, changed the look of the Chanel bag that we know nowadays. Okay, show me Denise. Yeah, it looks good. It looks really good. This lambskin actually still looks pretty good, huh? For a 22 series. It's still older, older, of course, of course. It holds up more. Do you want to try the it holds up longer. Can you like get them out? Yeah, you can buff them out a little bit. These are quite deep. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, who looks underneath your bag, right? You spotted a bag down there, right? Yeah, can you show me? <laughs> okay, so here we have a couple more beautiful reissue bags. Unfortunately, all with ruthenium hardware. We know I love gold. Um, this is actually an interesting piece. I have not seen this before. Um, yeah, is there anything else, Denise? Look at the Kellys. Mm. We're gonna go to Paris one day, right? We're gonna try our luck. Mm, Peyton. Ooh, what is this? <laughs> yeah, no, I think that's uh, too futuristic, even though it's an old bag. <laughs> um, yeah, let's see what other stuff we have here. So. Let me know again if anything catches your eye. We tried this one on last time. I think it's such a beautiful color. Um, yeah. Yes, and a couple of Gucci bags. Um, I love velvet so much. I think I would even accept a red bag if it's a velvet bag because the red is so vibrant. Yeah, okay. So, a couple more Chanel bags. We have a Chanel Urban Backpack. This is the last size um, and actually it's a good price I mean it's not everybody's color I guess that's why the price is so low this is a little bit one five. Oh, I would say definitely two five okay yeah and yeah, we have a good Ooh, a vintage Chanel camera bag with the famous tassel really nice yeah I think that's everything guys look at Harris at night isn't it pretty it's absolutely stunning. So down here, guys, we have to walk straight. <laughs> um, we're on our way to Selye and Pandora now. Denise, what are we saying? Um, we're saying... I mean, this is a really nice contrast. I like that. Um, boy bag. Yeah, that's pretty. And look at this fluffy Coco Handel. How cute is that? It's very cute. Yeah, that's perfect for winter, autumn and winter now, right? Mm -hmm. um, and there we have a beautiful, oh, look at the detail. Can we see the clasp from that um, burgundy flap over there? Oh, yeah, it's like it has like a little flower right there. And another boy bag. That is a nice flap. 
I mean, it's a single flap, it's just a seasonal piece, but I like the color. Mm -hmm. It looks like the one that we tried on in Bulgari, right? Mm -hmm. Hello, boys. Yeah. And there we have a beautiful python boy. Another every issue. A vintage piece in these, but not what you're looking for, it's huh? It's not the one we just saw. It's yeah. Beautiful issue. And yeah, guys, I think. Oh, they even have a couple scene. Oh, well, that's a big one. Yeah, and that should be. I think that's a GM size, which just got discontinued years ago. Now they even discontinued the MM size. Um, oh, no, is that a. <laughs> that's from the. Um, uh, yeah, so ah, Mirakami collection? They have a lot of yeah. 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 There's another one here. Oh, yeah. Cute. Cute, 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 cute. cute. They have, we have a little um, Dior bag and a huge Celine um, that is um, imprinted. It's croc print, basically. You know, it's not really croc, obviously. And there we have another really nice Dior bag. Okay, so we are at Pandora now. Let's see. This is the last time I was here, which was a long time ago. Yes, I mean, it's it's right. The color combination is not what everybody... Oh, look at this beauty. I love it. There's another little Chanel bag. Tell me immediately once you spot something. This is an old Chanel toad as well. It's so much to take in, right? When you come in here. Because they have so, so, so many bags. Um, yeah, it's really exciting. Okay, where do we go next? Oh, there's a boy bag. I spotted a boy bag. Should we look at that one? Let's look at this one here. Let's look at these beauties first. This is Valentino, right? Valentino Rockstar. I love the leather. <laughs> Simply because... Uh huh. <laughs> so this is their um, pre-loved, well, vintage exotic section. Um, which I think is always really, really interesting. Um, yeah, and there we have a couple of... They usually have a lot of um, MS bags hanging up there. So, ooh, is that a Bottega? I know, I never know where to look first, guys. I'm really sorry. I Oh yeah, this is a Bottega bag, right? That is huge! Unbelievable. Look at this little ostrich candy peekaboo. Hello. This is a nice one. And there we have a box car of Kelly. This is a vintage piece as well. This is quite old. Um, yeah, any more interesting bags right here? Ooh. Look at this golden clutch. Golden crocodile alligator clutch. Um, really interesting. And Alexander McQueen, Dior clutch. Yeah, and there we have another little... This is pretty cute. It's more like an east-west style as well. And of course, a beautiful boy bag. 2019? Yeah. The Metier de Art collection. Oh, I love Metier de Art pieces. Even these? Mm-hmm. This and is a vintage this. brooch, the double brooch. Oh. So nice. it hangs with the tassels. Mm. Then this is the so Chofa many Pearl. beautiful pieces. Yeah, that's the one with the bow from 2019. Mm -hmm. Then amazing. This is a limited edition. There was only two made in the UK. Oh. The cup. Yeah. What is this? Is it like a hairband? Yes. Oh. We've got a hairband and a matching belt. Oh, okay. And nice. There's some other ones in there. I love the Halloween decoration. <laughs> oh yeah. That's amazing. Are they all from one person? Did they get rid of this? Or is it just several people who brought um, their Metidia yeah. pieces in? The grey ones are from the one, the mm -hmm. white is for someone else. Okay. And then you've got the Egypt collection yeah. brooch. You don't have so many Birkins in at the moment as well, right? We I saw, saw them one after oh, the other. They oh. just like... Yeah, just yeah. go. <laughs> of course, with the current price increases. 1976. I mean, for that, it still looks amazing. <laughs> And I did not see this beautiful little belt bag. <laughs> mm, very disco style. I words, but I know you hate belt bags. <laughs> I do. Wow. But that's the mini plume. Ah, mini plume. That is really nice. And it's really got a long strap. Nice. Yeah. And it's, it's a hold for somebody. Oh, okay. It's a beautiful color. Here we have a beautiful Mew Mew bag. I, I actually like the style. It's just they don't hold their value, right? Yeah. That is the problem with Mew Mew. I think they make a lot of beautiful bags, but... Oh, look at these Dior's. Wow, look at this hardware. Oh, wow. That's a showstopper. Yes, and I saw a 
What is it here? Look at this one. This is a large Fendi Peekaboo. It's so beautiful. Um, we are on our way to the Ivy now to meet Patricia and then hopefully have dinner because I'm starving. Okay, so we are at the Ivy now and that looks amazing. <laughs> yeah, bon appetit. Yeah guys, so it feels like it's the middle of the night even though it's only, I don't know, 8 o'clock. Um, but it's so dark already, you know, it's really weird. And we were just walking past the boutique on, um, not Brompton Road, oh my god, what is it? Water Road, of course. Sorry, my brain, <laughs> I'm tired. So yeah, we were just walking past the Water Street boutique and I thought, let's have another look what they have here as well. So earlier we've seen the round purse, right? This is the rectangular one. It's already closed now, but I thought, nonetheless, let's have a look what they have in the window display at Chanel. This was my favorite Chanel store once, once my SA was still working here. Um, yeah, not a lot of people actually know about this, so when new collections are coming out, I think you have the best chance of finding a specific piece right in this boutique. Um, because most people go to Harrods, to Selfridges, you know, to, to other boutiques. This is quite unknown <laughs> on Water Street, so I can only recommend it. Yeah, there is the white version of the black one we've seen earlier. And another beautiful sequence, Chanel 19. And I can't believe it, this is the Coco Neige, the Coco Neige, um, sorry, there's a thingy here, right here. <laughs> this is the Coco Neige, um, small leather goods. They told us everywhere today, right, that they don't have them anymore with the little hooks. Um, but see, they still have them right here. Hello, it's the next day. Yes. Where are we today? <laughs> we are in Hampstead Heath. It's one of my favorite places in London. The views are incredible. Yeah, guys, and just to show you this incredible view. And yesterday the weather was horrible, right? It was just raining, raining, raining. I think today we're lucky. Oh, guys, look at this little cute buddy there. Seems like he doesn't want to go to his mama. He just likes that spot. That's his spot. <laughs> okay, so look where we are. My absolute favorite place in London. Yes. Kenwood House. Yeah, so we are in Bottega currently. So this bag I wanted to try on forever. However, it's so uncomfortable because this is actually like solid wood. Um, it is quite uncomfortable to actually wear it. Um, so I'm, I want to have another look at the beautiful pink Bottega Veneta chain pouch because I really want to add that even though I have a chain pouch already. <laughs> Don't tell anybody yet. <laughs> um, I've just fallen in love with the color of the love. She's currently getting it. Okay guys, so here it is. I love this color. Yeah. What do we think? It's, it's like, again. boom, yeah. out there. <laughs> yeah. Why am I such a sucker for pink and purple? I really don't know. I love it. Mm. My rule usually, but my rule usually is not to have the same models in different colors. You know, that's what I say. Is all the Bottega lookalikes, right? <laughs> I mean, the puffiness. They took that. They took the chain, obviously. That's very Bottega like inspired. It. I don't know. I like the black. Gold yeah. Thing. I love this color because I just love, oh no, I love gold, of course. Here we have the papillon trunk in the black epi leather. And I still love the monogram, even though I want to reduce my monogram collection. Um, but I think in this model, the monogram just looks the best. Yeah, guys, and another little sneak peek look into Chanel, where they did not want to let us film last time. <laughs> but I still want to give you a little overview of what's on this plate. Yeah, guys, look at this. Oh my god, I really want to try on the Himalayan Birkin. Uh, Himalayan Birkin. <laughs> Himalayan Lady Dior, of course. How stunning is this? And I really want to know how much they cost. That's what I want, please. That's all I want. I don't want anything else. I just want this one. Yeah, guys, so look at these beautiful Dior babies. You guys know how much I love them, but it's not your thing, right? Let's look at this beautiful eye candy at MS. I mean, can we believe it? There we have a little cray. Um, Kelly, ostrich Kelly, and look at that beautiful Birkin 25. So, so pretty. Look at the screen. That is mesmerizing. And especially with the malachite details again yeah. on the class, yeah. that is Perfect. just incredible. Let's see what we have here. So, we are at a bulgari in Harrods, and oh my god. <gasps> Can you see this lizard one with the little golden details? Oh god, oh god. And I always wanted to have a white top handle bulgari bag. 
and that's an exclusive so it seems like it's only a Harrods exclusive I think oh it's really gold plated yes. 22 carat <gasps> I always wanted to have like a white top handle bag, like a Bulgari Serpenti oh, yes. Forever, and this is like... Do we know the price? This is the one. This yeah. is 9,600. 9,600. Of course, it's lizard. It's incredible. Can I try it on? Of course you can. Thank you. Wow. Okay, I'm speechless. How beautiful is this? It was around 9,000 pounds. Um, but this is... They only have three in the world, and they were all sold here in Harris. Are the other ones sold already? Because um, you said it's three, right? Yeah, they were three, in one sold, two still available. Ah, two are still available. Okay, that is incredible. Oh, wow. <gasps> wow, 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 wow. That is so beautiful. That's a classic one, right? It's very yes. classic for women. Very durable. To be honest, more popular than the mm -hmm. these days. Yeah. For some reason. Karen was so durable. Yes. That's it's, but it's maybe a little bit too small for me. Yeah, they have this in the medium size as well. That's the one I want. And they have a baby blue version as well. How stunning is this? What do we think about Cartier bags? Look at this one. I have not seen it before. Let's look at the details. That is Pretty. This is a bigger size. It is so beautiful. Is this all the colors you have? Yeah, guys. So, what do we think about a Cartier bag? I mean, yeah, it's very subtle. I think it's interesting, isn't it? Yes. Let me have a quick look at it. Look at the beautiful jade stones. That is incredible. And this is. Champagne gold. You are a fan of the champagne gold instead of the rich gold, right? Aww. Can we just take a quick moment? Um, so thinking, 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 she can't make a decision. Uh, how beautiful are these million chains? Back, stunning. Mm -hmm. 